I'm Roseanne and this is 60 Radical Seconds. When we get to I'm always fascinated by drummers because they've got all this equipment in front of them. They've got things to do in their right hand, left hand, left foot, right foot. Some of the gigs that I do, I've got a left hand thing, a right hand thing, lots of pedals on the floor, and then on top I've got to sing. That takes a whole lot of coordination. Coordination is often a dilemma for those of us who are singer-songwriters, playing guitar and singing, playing keyboards and singing, or maybe you're an instrumentalist in a band, but you also sing background vocals. And there are those moments where, uh-oh, what I have to play are not the same notes as what I'm singing, are not the same rhythm. One of the things that really helps me to get coordinated is to clap and sing together. You can do this at home, you can do this in the park. It doesn't take any equipment, just your voice and your hands. One, two, three, the ghetto, main beats. The ghetto, this is two and four. Two and three's coming up. The ghetto. The ends, the ghetto. Here we go, the hard ones. The ghetto. The ghetto. Now you wanna add another layer of difficulty. So I will sing the answer to that phrase and clap on the same beats. The ghetto, talking about the ghetto. 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 The ghetto. Start out simple, but as you build up and you do more challenging songs, more challenging clapping patterns, you're gonna get a very solid internal clock. And if you're solid in your core like that, coordination is gonna get a lot easier.